goodbye VIP kid? Let me explain. So my name is Christina Garcia, also known as Teacher Tina. If you've been on my channel before, you're probably used to seeing a ton of VIP Kid related videos. Uh, there's, uh, you'll be seeing some new stuff. <laughs> so let me explain. About two months ago, my husband and I moved into a new house. Uh, we were super excited to move in. I, I, the first thing I hung up was my background for my classroom, like literally the first thing I hung up in the whole house. And I was just really excited to like set up my new classroom. The whole time we were building this house, I was like, this is where I'm going to have my classroom. When we had the studs up, I was like, that's my classroom, right? Um, and then we didn't have internet. <laughs> and it's really hard to teach online classes when you don't have internet. Um, so it took a while for us to get internet, and then once we got it, the speeds were horrible. I mean, like, one megabit per second, okay? So anyway, um, I was unable to teach with VIP Kid during the past couple of months, and I thought for sure that I would just be devastated over the loss, right? The loss of not being able to teach VIP Kid classes because I absolutely love VIP Kid, right? Um, not so much. <laughs> I'm just going to keep it keep it real with you. I I really miss my students. I do. I miss them so much. I love them, especially the ones that I got to meet in China. I just adore them and miss them every day. But I do not miss the classes themselves, and that's really hard for me to say. But I don't. And I'm going to be honest with you. Uh, so here's why I don't miss VIP Kid classes. Uh, number one, I got really tired of the curriculum, and this is not a direct reflection of VIP Kids curriculum. I'm confident that I would have gotten tired of teaching anybody else's slides in any other company, just teaching so many reptiles and birds all the time. You know, it just gets really repetitive. And so I got really tired of the curriculum itself and not having as much flexibility with it as I wanted. Now you can always, you know, teach how you want, use the props you want, kind of direct the conversation as you choose, but I, I really felt confined by the slides. Um, and it was really great for me to be confined by the slides when I was a new teacher because I didn't want to have to create content. But now that I've been around for a while, I would rather create my own. So anyway, that was the first thing, the first discovery I made by not teaching was that I really did not miss the curriculum at all. Um, and the second discovery I made was that I did not miss teaching in the morning. Uh, and so for VIP kids, since we're on China time, like I'm in the eastern part of the United States, it would be pretty early for me teaching. And I came to really, really enjoy my mornings. So I know that not everyone has the opportunity to kind of have your morning be whatever you want it to be. But over the past couple of months, I've really just enjoyed, you know, I still get up early. I've been getting up around 5 or 5.30, but then I work out and then I read, I shower, I have breakfast, you know, I journal, all that good stuff. And I just, it really sets me up for an amazing day. Um, whereas when I would teach for VIP Kid, even if I got up extra early to try to fit those things in, I was still always checking my clock, getting really stressed out about being late for a class. There was just no peace in my mornings at all. So those were my two discoveries that I was tired of the lessons themselves and I was tired of the hours with VIP Kid. Now, when I was a new teacher, those two things were perfect for me. I didn't have to create any content. I didn't have to teach, you know, later in the day, like I could choose my own schedule. Everything was great. And I still think that VIP Kid is great for so many people. I'm still helping people get hired for VIP Kid because I know that it can be a really great opportunity for so many people. And I still have resources available to people who are going through the hiring process. But for me personally, it was time for a change. So I was really excited when I started hearing that my friends were starting to teach for another company. Now this company, let me just say, I have been a VIP Kid purist from day one. I have not wanted to branch out into other companies. It felt like betrayal, right? Like I was just like, I'm going to do one thing and do it really well. <laughs> but then I got tired of VIP Kid. So um, the company that I've chosen to work for that I just got hired with is called OutSchool. Now let me tell you a little bit about OutSchool in case you are interested in that. And no pressure to use my referral link, I just wanna make sure that you know about this opportunity. So OutSchool is like the most flexible online teaching job I have ever heard of, ever. Um, so it is teaching children ages three through 18. Teachers need to be at least 18 years old. 
They can live in the US, Canada, Australia, New Zealand, the UK. Um, basically, the, these places are the ones that you can live in uh, because they need to be able to do a background check on you. Uh, but anyway, those are the requirements, right? And then you have to have passion and kind of like expertise in something. Now, when it says expertise on their website, it does not mean that you have to be an expert and you have to have certifications. The classes can be about anything, which is what I find to be so interesting. There are classes about how to tie your shoes, right, for really young learners. There are classes about making music. There are classes about making pasta. There are classes about Spanish. There are, like every topic you could possibly think of is on that website. If you don't believe me, go and check it out. You can use my referral link, even if you're not signing up, just to go and see what's on there. Um, maybe you have learners at home who would enjoy taking a random class like that. They're really cool classes. Uh, so anyway, without school as a teacher, you have so much flexibility. You choose what the class is about. You create the content for the class, whether you're gonna have lesson slides or whatever. It's done on Zoom. You choose the age range that you would like to advertise your classes for. Uh, so, you know, maybe the range is three to 18, but maybe you want to have four to six year olds, you know, whatever range you want to have. Um, you choose the ideal class size so that they can max out. Like, let's say that you only want six kids in your class. You can max it out at six kids. Um, and then you choose, you ready for this? You choose the price. You choose how much you are charging for your class. And that's the real kicker. That was the one thing that I was like, there's no way that you get to choose that. But really the market speaks for itself. You choose the price and if people are willing to pay for what you're doing, they'll enroll in your class. <laughs> and then if they're happy, they'll leave a review and you'll get more business. So it's a really, really cool thing that you can really, really build your business exactly how you want to. Um, I was really surprised to hear that there were no upfront costs without school because I thought surely you have to like pay to become a teacher and be on their platform and that kind of thing. But actually they just take a percentage of whatever you earn. So if you get on there and you don't earn very much, you don't pay very much in the fees. So basically um, they pay you on PayPal and they pay you 70%. So the company keeps 30%, which I think is a steal for the fact that they are taking care of all of the logistics, right? They are attracting the students. They have the platform, everything. So anyway, they use Zoom, but it's it's really, really cool. So anyway, I just wanted to make sure that you were aware of this opportunity because I'm super excited about it. I just got hired with them and I'm getting ready to teach my first classes. Um, and so, yeah, I hope that this video was encouraging to you. Um, I debated making this video because I thought, well, gee, like I, I haven't actually taught classes on this platform yet, but I have several friends who have taught classes on this platform and I'm in the process. So I thought I just might as well share this as soon as possible so that you know about it. You can start the hiring process if that's something that interests you. Um, like I said, I, I do have a referral link below. That referral link can do two different things for you. If you're interested in teaching, it can um, get you to the website to apply, right? If you're interested in having your, your kids take classes or maybe your nephew, niece, grandkid, whatever, you can get classes on there and by using my link, just it's the same link whether you're taking classes or teaching classes, by using that link you get a $20 credit, which is really, really cool. So anyway, if you have any questions, feel free to post them in the comments below. OutSchool also has a Facebook community that's really, really helpful, so I'll link that below as well. Okay, thank you so much. I am not leaving VIP Kid. I'm just kind of, I took a hiatus and I discovered a lot of things. <laughs> so anyway, I didn't mean to hurt your feelings, Dino. I still love my students. I'm still with VIP Kid, but it's time for me to branch out into something new. So I look forward to hopefully teaching on out school with you. Thank you. Bye.